I'm talking. Sorry. Where are we going? Mitchell's Bay! For what? To, I'm going swimming. My dad brought the kayak and we even got Daisy Poo. And your mom. Yes, and my mommy. All right, I know there's not a whole lot of daylight left, but we made it to Mitchell's Bay. It's about 35 minutes from our house. Not bad at all. Um, I'm going to go show you some wildlife over here in a second. But this is what we got. So we got a canal over here for our small inlet. This is called Mitchell's Bay over here behind me. Now that water out there is shallow. It's probably two to three feet deep and it goes out for about four to six hundred meters like that. It's really shallow, really shallow. A lot of bass, big, big bass live in this lake. There's a very nice trailer park over in that area over there. Walpole Island's down there and it's got a bunch of marsh area. Great for duck hunting and great for big bass. And no, you can't see it way, way across there. That is Michigan. Yeah, no, that's not Michigan. I know a lot of people around the world, they love the Canadian goose. Here in Canada, not so much, unless I'm eating them. They breed by the dozens. One over here, we're gonna have a quick look at, uh, I see two adults, four adults, and look at the litter these four adults have. I keep in mind there's two males and two females. Unless they're binary. All right, now when we hunt those during waterfowl season, you're not allowed very much. You should be only allowed two. I think you're now allowed three. I'll have to check the regs on that, but can you imagine? That's how they breed. That's why we have way too many of them. Anyway, I think Ella wants to go in the water, so let's head down to the water. Well, it is a Tuesday night, which means there's not many people here, which is a good thing. Uh, they've only got two, four, five, six, seven picnic tables in the entire park. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Seven picnic tables. Still a nice place to come. It's usually pretty quiet. I have been here when it's uh, packed, which is not a lot of fun because there's not much beach space. If you look over here, all the way over there, there's only about 125 yards or meters of uh, beach space. So real estate's kind of at a premium. The rest of the stuff behind me here, it's all rocks all the way up to that beach. It's a nice place to come. It's all pretty family oriented. Looking at the picnic tables, they're not all graffitied up. So it's a nice place to come, especially when I want to get out of the city. out of her mind that water's like ice it's may 25th <laughs> it's cold so according to google mitchell's bay has approximately 350 full-time residents in the dead of summer, when it's hot out, I would imagine that would grow to many, many, many thousand. Everybody trying to cram in on this beach, then everybody else out bass fishing. We're gonna go out over on the pier here and walk out and have a look and see what it's like. Mitchell's Bay Wharf. 